Ahoy everyone, welcome to City Skylines. My name is Captain Corndog and this is the city of Cliff Point. Alright, so I ran the city for a few minutes while I was deciding what I should make for this episode and as you can see from the bottom of the screen we're in desperate need of more housing for our growing population. So in this video, I'm making a pretty big apartment complex for our citizens to live in. I'm designing this complex based on one that's in my city in real life with a few differences. The apartments these are based off of have over 70 buildings and I didn't want that many in this tiny area, so I cut the number to about half. They also have a small two or three hole golf course as well, but I plan on adding a golf course to our leisure area later down the line, so I decided against adding one here. The main thing that I wanted this complex to revolve around was the lake in the center. I had some issues with it, but eventually I got it to the level I needed it to be without flooding the surrounding buildings. Just like in the last couple videos, I'm mostly going to let the time lapse run and come in later in the video to wrap things up, but I wanted to jump in real quick to just give an overall take on the whole build. Like I said before, I didn't want a ton of buildings in this area since they all look exactly the same. But maybe that's more accurate since the ones these are based off of look exactly the same as well. I don't know. The only problem I had with these particular buildings was that the realistic population mod had them set to one household per building. And from what I can see just from the outside, there seem to be at least 16 apartments in each of them. I figured each apartment would have at least two bedrooms, so I went in and added a custom household number of 32 households per building. I plan to put the city's main college in this general area in the future, so this will probably end up being filled with students so they can be within walking or biking distance of campus. I've been really enjoying making this city even though we're only about 8 episodes in at the moment. Every time I start planning the next area I find some new assets or a mod that's really helpful. I've been using the parking lot roads mod more often lately and I found a mod that really helps with it. It's called Parking Lot Snapping by Yin Yang and Super Poncho. It really helps to get the parking in the perfect spots to make sure to get as many cars as possible in the lot. Another mod I'm using in this episode that I didn't have in the last one is the Undo It mod. This mod is going to be a lifesaver later down the line when I eventually screw something up on accident and I won't have to struggle to figure out how I'm going to fix it. Not really sure if it was my game or just this specific day, but the theme of this video was assets not working properly and I don't know why. I had a pavilion that didn't seem to want to work properly, some people props that kept sinking into the ground, water props that didn't look right. It was a mess, but I eventually got things to look somewhat realistic. I think once the city gets built up, I'll more than likely go to different areas and fix the landscaping around them and make them blend in more. I'm still new to building cities with lots of mods and assets, so I've neglected the landscaping in a couple areas, mainly the school and the shopping center, but we'll fix those in another video. Alright, so I'm going to let the video play from here. Hope you guys enjoy the build. See you in a few minutes.
All right, guys, after these last few things, that's going to wrap up this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hit that like button if you did enjoy. Let me know in the comments what you'd like to see me add to the city and join the Discord down in the description and say hello. And make sure to subscribe and hit the bell so you can see every video when it comes out. Thanks again for watching. Have a great day.